you junk. Nobody reads my announcements anyway, so who gives a crap? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I so do not take myself seriously ever. Oh, I have too much fun with life sometimes. I, I wonder I wonder if anyone's going to uh catch on to it. I I wonder if anyone knows the song reference that's from. There's a couple who might. Oh. Tell you what, man, it got cold here. You still there? Well, I hate Comcast. <laughs> I figured that was it. <laughs> it's just like I mm okay. I it probably know. dropped me mid-sentence. No, it didn't drop you mid-sentence. I mean, I just started going yada, 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 blah, 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 blah. And then I just heard nothing from you. I'm like, what the? Anyway. What happened? Oh, heck if I know. <sighs> do, you, do you like my, uh, my, uh, my live notification? Uh, I don't know. I haven't got that far because I heard you were uh, typing in the live notification. I went to go pull up Twitch. And then my first indication that I was that I dropped connection was Twitch telling me Klein, do you want to try to reconnect? Oh, like, well, my, uh, my, my announcement says, here, I'll, I'll, I'll say it in just a moment. Oh, by the way, by the way, my, uh, sombrero now has mm. a piece. It, it, my sombrero now has a piece of flair. You went to shenanigans? I, I I was influenced by shenanigans. It now has a little twitch pin right here on the front of my nice. sombrero. So my, my sombrero... As, as is appropriate. My sombrero hath bling. But yeah, the, uh, the, the announcer says, blah, 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 Stormblood, blah, 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 FF14, yeah, yeah, yeah. You didn't even care what we say. It's always yeah, 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 yeah. Blah, 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 blah. All we ever hear from you is yeah, yeah, yeah. All we ever do is just a yeah, yeah, yeah. You didn't even, didn't even care about what they say. It's just yeah, 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 yeah. Blah, 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 blah. I feel like I'm doing the chicken dance. This is weird. All right, enough, enough, enough of that. <laughs> We're moving on here. Okay. So... Took care of a couple of uh, little quests today. So we are now uh, moving on. Oh, with... that's right. You did the uh, you did the afternoon stream. Yes, I did the afternoon stream. And um, did um, did a couple of the um, ether current quests. Nice. All right, Yagiri, what do you got for me? Oh, I have to refrain from useless violence? Dude. Never get to when kill is nobody. Why violence useless? I never get to kill nobody. That's because you're a white mage. Dabu, we will have more stops to make today. Play. <laughs> we will use our blowguns to incapacitate them. I love it. Regardless of your familiarity with such weapons, you are a veteran warrior, and I am sure it will come naturally to you. Um, do you know how hard it is to aim a freaking blowgun? 
I don't have first-hand knowledge, but I assume it, uh, oh. Oh, no, Will, we lost you. We lost you again, Will. Oh. No, I'm here. Okay. I saw that you logged out. <laughs> I shouldn't be. You shouldn't be logged out of. Wait, I've been logged in all this time. Uh, Ugh. it literally just said Soraya Ether just logged out. Yeah, because I was just trying to log in with another one of my characters. And it said, this character is already logged in. Intriguing. Oh, my balls. What is this? I have a freaking sniper rifle. No, you have a blowgun. I have a sniper blowgun. <laughs> Dude, if those are flaming hot Cheetos, I will murder you right now. No. Okay, thank you. No. They're only my, my most... There are only my only favoritest of favorite chips. If they are anything Cheetos, you're As... still dead. No. Okay, good. They are, as advertised on the packaging, 65% less fat than the regular version of said item. Uh... Because they are baked Lay's. Baked Lay's barbecue? Baked Lay's plain. Oh, plain. It's got no soul to them. Well, yes, because I'm dead inside. Because they're not a soul chip. Ba -ba -ba -da -da -ba -ba. I'm a soul man. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -da -ba -ba. Oh, man. I tell you what. My, my wife and I watched, like, ten minutes of the halftime show yesterday. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Halftime show of what? Um, the halftime show. Uh, Super Bowl. Is that, that a new series on Netflix? Uh, the oh, Super, Super Bowl. Oh, Super Bowl was yesterday? Yeah. Oh, okay. Up. Oh. One, dos, tres. That's right. Fall. Oh, I wanted him to fall up the cliff. Cuarto. Oh, oh. Go long. Go long. Dude. That is, those are freaking lungs of steel, man. I mean, she dropped that guy from like a hundred yalms. All right, let's see here. Where is she? Down here? Down here. But, yeah, so, um, um, the, um, Oh, what was I? I mean, other than it was like sexual, 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 blah, 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 sexual, blah, blah, blah. Um, what I found was very... Oh, it, my. No, it was, it was bad. It was just like, really? Like, like what, like what, what honestly annoys me about it is... Those people are held up. <gasps> They're such wonderful role models for women. Um, J-Lo was feeling herself up. Um, the, the, she was feeling up her undercarriage while on stage. You see. And there was a camera that's placed. That's something you do on a stage. And there was a camera placed to where the entire world could very easily tell that um, that she had um, jock itch. Well, we will call it jock itch because uh, she was uh, definitely trying to itch something down there. So, uh, yeah. 
I'm just like, how is this empowering women? I don't get it. Like, I'm trying to. Help me out here. I mean, I will. I am willing to do I... more research on this method of empowering women. But something tells me. I don't I don't think that's empowering women. I don't I don't think so. I I can't speak to it because I haven't seen it. It it was but it was a strip tease. My assumption is that if I that, that my assumption is that were I to have seen it, I would agree with you wholeheartedly. Yeah, my wife my wife turned the thing off. I'm like, yeah, no. Not in front of my 3-year-old and my 6-year-old girls. Yeah, no thank you. And then, of course, Jeb Bush gets on Twitter, best halftime show ever. And the only thing I was thinking was, he ain't nothing but a hound dog. Crying all the time. Because <laughs> he was watching his TV going, oh, oh, oh. Because, I mean, he's old enough to know back in the day with the wolf banging on the table and shouting, when whistling towards the uh, the dame with the tomatoes and the gams, you know, he he's old enough for that, right? And those are fruit, people. Yes, those are fruit. <laughs> anyway, that's that's enough football talk. But hey, the uh, speaking of football talk, uh, so congratulations to the Kansas City Chiefs. And uh, the winningest coach in the NFL, who also happens to be a member of the church. And, uh, oh, really? Yes. He is a faithful member of the church. And um, he, there is a couple, one or two BYU players on the team. And he is now the winningest coach that finally has a Super Bowl. <laughs> Who goes there? Show your soul. Anyway, so yes, congratulations to the Kansas City Chiefs, which is apparently located in Missouri or Missouri. Depends on if you live there or not. Because apparently our president was a little hasty with a tweet. And I thought that was kind of funny. But, of course, Twitter can't can't let things go. Twitter cannot let things go. What? I'm I, shocked. I'm I, shocked by that. I know. Shocked, I say. Shocked. Mm -hmm. Twitter Twitter actually can take a can take a joke and, you know, jokingly, jokingly let something slide? No. Mm. All right. Let's see here, Yagiri. What do you got for me? Oh, the lovely conscripts. Oh, cute. <sighs> Duties. Duty. <laughs> I felt bad because my baked lays are almost gone. Yeah, I burned through a whole bag of Maui sweet Maui sweet onion or sweet Maui onion chips in two days. I feel like a glutton. There's a reason I don't buy chips for myself very often. Mm -hmm. It's a it's a bad idea, but I but I feel okay since I got my six miles in this morning. I, I I'm feeling okay with myself. Although no matter how hard I try, I couldn't seem to get my dang heart rate down to where I wanted it to be. I swear, in order to get my heart rate down low enough to where it should be for the type of training I wanted to do, I would have to power walk. Like, zero jogging in order to get my heart rate that low. I'm just like, okay, this is dumb. I'm just going to go 
Nice and slow. Keep my heart rate down. But yeah, it is insanely windy over here right now. Cause um I was I was running up a quasi major street and I got hit with this blast. Oh my gosh. Ooh. Well that's nice. Oh, hold up. Let me update my gear set. There you go. Yugiri is in her element. Oh boy. Is Yugiri gonna bust loose? Um, I don't know. Let's see, infiltrate. Bust and Quite move. Quite possibly, she is an she is a ninja. She, I am ninja. You are ninja, and I am Leva. You are ninja too. Do you know I am ninja? That big um, head thing looks very creepy. Ask a ninja? Yes, ask a ninja. No, I mean, I'm aware of its existence. Am I, you know, familiar, familiar? Not particularly. Okay. Oh, hey, someone else is doing the same quest too. Stand by and watch for Imperial patrols. Okay, so I need to go here and watch for Imperial patrols. Yeah, I am Ninja on uh, YouTube. It's good fun. Except don't listen to him about net neutrality. He's full of crap. Oh, wait a second. Net neutrality. No, net neutrality is garbage. No, he, he, he has a couple episodes about net neutrality, and it's all absolute leftist garbage. I have actually had a lot of friends get, um, oh. They're all, uh, no, you sign off first. I, I, I like this one, Stocky Soldier. No, you sign off first. No, you sign off first. <laughs> that's, that's that's a nice little wait, Easter egg wait, right there. Wait, 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 wait. So, so wait. Are 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 you are you gonna steal their uniforms? Um, that might be a little awkward. Especially the stocky soldier. Well, cause he's at, he wants you to to. Uh, he wants you to log off before he does. Right. Ah, yes. You have your pick of the uniforms. They shall not protest. Let's take the strapping soldier. Little small for your tastes. <laughs> Well, I, you know, oh, congratulations. You yeah, I mean, you could try the spindly soldier, but... No, do you do you know what that's referencing? I know exactly what that's referencing. No, I don't. That is an homage to Final Fantasy VI. In the, okay. uh, in the first chapter with Locke the Thief, you're required to steal two separate uniforms. And then he explicitly states, the uniform is a little small for my tastes. So with a few minor adjustments, it appears as though it, it could suffice. That's like ah. almost verbatim what Locke says in uh, Final Fantasy VI. So. And that, my friends, is the sound of one William Paul guzzling the tiny remains of a bag of baked, la baked lays. Am I wrong? No, you're not wrong. <laughs> Son, did you eat the entire piece of cake in one bite? No. Oh. 
Quickly, who shot Alexander Hamilton? Alexander Hamilton, killer? Aaron Burr. Aaron Burr. Aaron Burr. Come on, man. Old Got Milk commercial. Aaron Burr. Dude. You don't know your Got Milk commercial lore? How dare you? Uh oh. Hold up. I got a text. Oh. It's my pops in law. Oh, balls. Oh my gosh. There's like literally a foot of snow outside my father in law's door. Holy crap. Oh, here I was freezing my nanes off at a mere 46 degrees this morning. Right now it's 50. It's supposed to get down. Oh! We are actually close to freezing tomorrow. It's going to be 37 degrees at 6 a.m. It is a dang good thing I'm not running tomorrow. Oh, thank you. Did you hear me? Nope. But, okay, so I was just saying that my my weather app says that it's uh, currently 34 degrees. <laughs> it's supposed to be 37 at 6 a.m. tomorrow here. Oh, oh, you are on stream in disguise. Do you know what this means? What? It means that there is an audio drop that I can finally play because it is relevant. <laughs> oh no. Uh, let me just make sure I, I find it. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? All right. Me, I know who I am. I'm a dude, the dude, the dude. <laughs> Wait a minute, what's that from again? D is it familiar? It is familiar. I know that line. Tropical Thunder. Tropic Thunder. Yep. Robert Downey Jr. Playing the black man. <laughs> Which I will say this for Tropic Thunder. Aside from anything else, it has got the best Tom Cruise. Yeah, I need to I need to watch that movie. I've heard I've heard that is a very funny movie. I actually think I have that sound drop. But yeah, I have been sitting on that one for a while. <laughs> and I was just like, I, I need to wait until he is in uniform. Yeah, in, in disguise, in game. Right. Guide the villagers towards freedom! Yay! Escort mission! Okay, not exactly. Escort mission! Yeah, because those went over so swell. 
<laughs> and left oh, alive. And left alive. Oh, yeah. they just went over so good. This is like the opposite of safe. <laughs> <laughs> I told I told Mrs. The Feral that, and she even she laughed at that. She goes, "That was seriously a light in your game." I'm like, "I know," and this is supposed to be like a tote serious sneaky sneak simulator. <laughs> <gasps> oh no, seriously, that game is definitely living up to the hype of just the absolute most garbage game I've ever played. Because I mean, sincerely, yeah. even even the graphics are garbage. Because it just feels like there's just this haze like an unintentional haze listen to me all of you we have dealt with the imperials for now but you must flee this place quickly uh... flee <laughs> Dealt with Arr, you. What? Arr. you didn't kill them did you oh I mean, okay screw you formidable farmer you are not acting very formidable right now are you mad? <laughs> There's no escaping the Empire. Running will only make it worse. We can never beat them. Never, ever, ever beat them. Never. You can't. You can't ever beat them. No, you can't ever, ever. Oh. <gasps> the gasp. To stay is to die. You know this to be true. Even if you lack the will to fight, surely you have the will to live. Or has that, too, been beaten out of you? Is this what has become of Doma? Oh, 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 we're all concerned a kiss. Nurr. Look, you know, people, you need to listen to Joya. You were Lord Hean's retainer. Because she knows what she's talking about. Question. Well, we're not. We're lost and afraid. She knows what she's we talking about. This, all of this. But we can't do a damn thing to change it. And trying will only make it worse. Do you hear the people sing, singing the songs of pitiful men? They are the songs of people who have been beaten to a pulp. They are big, gigantic wuss cakes. They do not know the meaning of fight. They would rather run and... Dang it, I lost it. I lost it. <laughs> uh, it's probably a good thing. It's probably a good thing. Some will fall I and no some will live. Na, 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 Do you hear no, the seriously. people sing, singing the songs of angry men? It is a sight of the people who will not be slaves again. It's a pathetic existence, but it's all we got. And when people like you come here pretending mm. it can be different, it it doesn't help. All right. Dude, you need a good slap. Just slap him. Slap him. Please, boy. They they Please. need to they need to listen to Joya because she why? Came to help, and for that we she, should be grateful. We're on a mission from God. <laughs> and the sooner they realize that, the sooner they can get behind you. Elder, your face. We all have scars. Some too many to bear. Too many battles. Too much lost. Our friends, our family, even our liege. We who survived are forced to bend the knee, to sell our souls and surrender our dignity. How are we to lift our heads when this shame weighs so heavily upon us? Your courage, your resolve. <laughs> If they only knew what you would do for them, my lord. You've made your plight clear, and I shall impose my will no Okay. More. But know this, brothers and sisters of Doma. I... Okay. I've just run across a character. For all you have suffered. <sighs> For all First the name and the ignominy, you are still O M F G W H Y O M G Y Last name D O I S U C K Um 
So full name is OMFG. Why do I suck? <laughs> oh, good golly. <laughs> My lord. My lord prays you value your life as highly that as is, he does. Uh, as for me, I swear by all the karmi in creation uh, that I will free someone you Someone who does not take themselves seriously no at all. Mm. If the Imperials come for me, I will tell them we were tricked by an Ori woman. Tell them whatever you must to keep your loved ones safe. Alpha Alpha. Mm -hmm. Flee! Flee! Why would you... After everything... Because, East, unlike you, we don't suck at everything. We refuse to suck at everything. Mm -hmm. We refuse to let our lives be run by jerk faces. We tell the jerk faces, forget you jerk faces. We're gonna make life awesome. And there ain't a dang thing you can do about it. Indeed. Darn tootin'. <sighs> I swear, Joya wearing that mask, it just looks like she's just giving a cold, icy stare. Oh, there's a reason I kept that outfit in my glamour chest. Rank up! Rank up! Rank up! Yugiri is comp contemplated. <sighs> right. Gather up the Imperial Decurion. So yeah, I just realized uh, my snowboard is in fact 10 years old. <laughs> okay. Cause I found this I found this service from a Facebook ad where apparently uh there is a group of individuals that actively help you find and purchase a snowboard. Yeah. So um they're they're riding experts. Did they email you and say did they email you and say, Hey, we helped you get your uh get your snowboard ten years ago. Isn't it time for a new snowboard? No. I bought I bought my snowboard off of a uh, one of those deal a day discount uh, websites. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I mean I got. I mean I wouldn't put it past a company like that to do something like what I described. Right. No, but um, I I purchased my entire writing kit. So this is board bindings bag boots, pants, and jacket. I got everything for 300 bucks. Nice. Which for a whole snowboarding outfit, outfitted, that is dang cheap. Yeah. Oh, crap. We're going to get the heck out of Dodge on this one. All right, 
There we go. But um, but what I'm hoping for is they give me a good recommendation for a board that is uh, a heck of a lot lighter than what I have right now. Because <laughs> uh, cause my current board is a tank. Gosh, dang it. Get away from me. Well, I would think that depending on what you want to do with your snowboarding, sometimes you may want or need a tank board, but, you know, hey, not all the time. No, my, my problem is, quite frankly, I need a lighter board just because it is really cranking on my knee when I go up on the ski lift. And, ah. um... Yeah, it's it, it's not it's not a question of being able to ride it, um, and I only get to go once a year, and um, so like I only go once a year, and that time that I go, I go to the same resort, um, mainly because I know all of the trails, I know exactly what I'm riding, and go. Mm -hmm. oh, Darn you, stupid ratchet, ratchets. Get away from me. Um, so, and I only ride groomed trails. Like, I don't ever ride, like, black diamonds or back backcountry or anything like that. So, I, yeah. I, I stick to blues and greens. That's all I do. Just because I like to ride. I don't like jumps. I don't like spins. I mean, I'll hit up a... Um, they have some mini terrain parks on the mountains, but it's literally like a three-foot wide slider box that's only six inches off the ground. So uh, I get to live out my SSX dreams sliding on a three-foot wide box. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, grind it out, baby. Woo! And that's it. <laughs> But, um, you know, if you get the excitement from it and you understand that, yeah, uh huh, then that's quite all right. No, and yeah, and, and that's that's like my whole thing. Yes, I absolutely love boarding. I love wakeboarding. I love surfing. I love snowboarding. I'm not necessarily that adva that skilled on any of those boards. But I love being out there, like even with surfing. I mean, I can go a full session in the waves and not really catch a single wave. But you know what? I had a good time. I was out there. I was in the water. I was smelling the salt and chatting with a couple of my buddies. It's a good morning. Okay. So... This is now what we're going to go ahead and try to do. It is now midnight for me. Okay. I am going to attempt to go up to bed and to sleep. Okay. So that I can potentially get up around 6.30, 7 o'clock-ish. Okay. It's not nearly as bad as trying to go to bed right at 10.30 when I got home. But it's still earlier than what my wife said that I would be allowed to, to stay up according to her her determination. So, Well, we can do. There is a very easy way to see if you're actually going to make this happen in terms of being awake at a decent hour of the morning. You are more than welcome to report during my morning bike stream when I am up <laughs> at 5 a.m. Well, I, I, I usually get on the bike at about 5.15. Um, yeah, which would be about 8.15 my time. Which should give you plenty of time to wake up, get, get, get dolled up for the day. Get purdied up. Oh, no. Oh, oh. trust me. Since I don't have to be at work until 5 p.m., oh. <laughs> I ain't going up until about 3 or 4 p.m. <laughs> trust me on that. Oh, boy. Yeah. 
No, honestly, honestly, though, we, we were talking earlier. Look in, look into those couch to 5K plans. I, I, I think I it'll will. do you a lot of good. I think it'll do you a lot of good. It calms me, the sound. Because, because the, the, the way it goes in terms of running is your first big milestone, so to speak, is usually the 5K. Because yeah. doing three miles at a time takes a bit of effort to be able to do it. And then, yeah. so then, honestly, when you get to being able to do, and, and honestly, you don't have to do those dumb 5K races. 5K races are just dumb. Most of them, most of them are, unless it's a it's a fundraiser for a good cause or something or other, most of those 5K runs are just dumb. Just go out and run a 5K and, and pop on some Rocky music and be a champion. That's all you have to do. <laughs> but then... Uh, speaking... Speaking of various, you know, Rocky music and, and, and that stuff, have you seen the movie Creed? No, but I know it exists. Okay. It actually is a fairly good Despite reboot the of the Rocky franchise. Uh-huh. In truth, I am not So, I, I do recommend that movie. Okay. I was born beneath the waves of the rude but, sea. I'm procrastinating now. So you are procrastinating. I'm going to jump out of voice chat. <laughs> All right. All right. Good night, Will. I'll see you tomorrow, man. All right. To think that you were there, that you even spoke with my mother and father. Oh. They are in good health then. The knowledge is of great comfort to me. I like this music. This is good. That I might have the strength to protect my home from the Empire. I left to learn the secrets of the Shinobi. Day and night we trained, ever striving to exceed our mental and physical limits. After a time, my skills were recognized, and I was dispatched to assist the Doman Liberation Front. Yeah, sorry I'm not talking much. This is a pretty heavy story part. So I just kind of want to enjoy it, as they say. Me. Good men all, brave and true, so clear their eyes, so pure their purpose. Any shinobi would have been proud to serve them and Doma. But, in the end, I will always be of the sea. Every day, I pray for my home and for the people I left behind. That they might be spared the wages of war and live in peace, untouched by this madness. I confessed this to Lord Hien once. Do you know what he said to me? Alpha, Alpha. He said, good. We are better for the conviction of our allies and draw inspiration from their example. What is weak alone may together grow stronger. Never did I lose faith in them. Even when all was lost and I led our people to Eorzea, I clung to the belief that our dream would one day be realized. But when I gazed into those eyes bereft of hope, when those broken men balked at liberty, the dream was shattered. It will not always be so. Yeah, this is a really good track. I like this one a lot. So I pray, and thus do I labor to see a new day dawn, regardless of my misgivings. When all is said and done, we can but carry on, together. I am curious. I wonder who won the Iowa caucus. Sorry. I'm being a little... scatterbrained tonight. An Imperial airship.
Oh, zero percent reporting. Okay, never mind. <laughs> it's more. I'm just curious if more than anything. It is bound for Doma Castle. Quickly, we must rejoin the others. Is the next one 220 to the north? Okay, let's get let's get this next one. Let's get this little free experience right here. There go, there's that free experience. So 220 alms to the north, so that is going to be somewhere in this region. I figure since I'm down here already, might as well look for these ether currents. Southeast. It's over this way. Ah, get up there. There it is. Probably on the other side. Yeah, it's gonna be on the other side of this river here. So we were just plucking away at a few things here. We are going to be up in this region somewhere.
Up oh, there it is. All right. Ah, oh, it takes care of this one. Oh. Hate it when I hit that button. To the west. That sounds like a contradiction, but I definitely ate way too much pizza. Hmm. Be it down here. Let's see here. North. Oh, there it is. Well, I hope everyone's having a good evening tonight. I had a pretty good day today, personally. Work went pretty good. We have a new uh, massive dive tank we're building for uh, for the Navy. So that's going to be our second massive diving pool. Let's see here. What else do we have? Uh, to the... Okay, so that's going to be that's going to be way in the butt over there. Okay. Okay, so we're going to go back to... Gonna go back to Namai. Nam yeah, throw my boots back on. Boots. Mm. All right, let's see here. Now, how far is this one? Oh, nice! That put me just about exactly where I needed to go. Hmm. Oh, west. This way. Ah, oh, there we are. I 
back up for this one. There goes uh, one of my trash cans right there. <laughs> like I said, this this wind is just nuts. There we are. All the way up there. All right, let's see if that's the last one. Might be the last one. Nope, oh, southwest. So that's all the way down there. All right. All right, head back there. All right, time to move on. All right. Oh, now let's see here. Um, travel, either currents. So I still need one quest. Yeah, that's going to be in the. Uh, that's definitely going to be in the next area. But I only need one more. Not really much that I can do. I'm just going to have to hoof it all the way down. Alright, so what we're going to do is we are going to head on over first. So we're going to head over, we're going to tune to the Aetherite. And then we are going to head due south and we are going to get us... Swim, swim for your life. Oh, no, 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 I'm going the wrong way. There we go. Much, much better. Oh, so anyway, oh, excuse me. As I mentioned earlier in the broadcast, um, unfortunately, uh, those who have been uh, paying attention and tuning in. Um, I'm not. I got formally accepted to uh, enter the Triton Man competition, but can't make it happen. I am, uh, I cannot logistically get make it happen. Wait a minute. I can't determine this. Oh, oh, I'm a dummy. I forgot it did. That's not how I get there. That's right. That's right. I forgot. That is going underneath the lake. All right, anyway, we are going to, we're going to head due south, I think. Yeah. So we're going to, let's 
So we're going to head due south and then um, That little land bridge over there to cross. Because this is the final aether current for this area that I need. So I will. Well, this is the final of the uh, searching ones. Then I will only need one more. So that's going to be in here. Yep, it is right there, and that jerk is in my way. Okay, now to actually go to the House of the Fierce. Because now I have done. What? Oh. Hold up. Sorry about that. I had something annoyingly get in my eye. Love it when that happens. I love the fact falls cannot kill you in this game. Whoosh. Very much wishing. There you are. What happened? Are the villagers all right? We freed them, along with many others. Gosetsu, we spied an airship bound for the castle. Know you aught of it? Know you aught of it. We do. The crown prince is come to Doma. Doma. We suspect this is a result of recent events in Gear Abani. Our defeat notwithstanding, there appears to be some concern in Garlemal that subversive elements may be rallying in other provinces. Oh. Excuse me. Though Yotsuyu governs Doma, 
Xenos remains the province's anointed viceroy, and it would seem he has come to assess the current situation in person. If Xenos is here, we must seize this opportunity and kill him. Yes, we must kill him. Would that it were so simple, Lady Yugiri. You may recall that we encountered Xenos at Rolga's Reach. We have seen firsthand what he can do. His power defies explanation. He faced the Alliance, the Resistance, and the Scions, and he defeated us all. We survived and learned from the experience, it is true. But if we are to defeat him, it will not be through simple opportunism. We will require a flawless plan. Flawless victory. We know his strength. A prodigious swordsman trained from childhood by the finest Imperial tutors, reputed to be without equal on the battlefield, which is why we must not meet him there. Nay, we keep to the shadows, the domain of the Shinobi, and thence we strike. You need only give me the chance. Were this but a matter of personal revenge, I would not presume to buy your path. For I myself crave that same vengeance. But to draw steel against the Emperor's son is a grave decision, and one that will shape our nation's future. Do not forget Lord Hien's words. What, that we should sheathe our swords if the people lack the will to fight? I will not squander this opportunity. If we do naught, our master's life is forfeit. Even should you succeed, Xenos' death will not win Doma her freedom. More likely, her doom. Can we defend our Well, then we'll just murder the, the next one, shall we? We few against a legion? Do not be a fool, child. Ooh, child, things are gonna get easier. Ooh, child, things are gonna get be, brighter. But I cannot, I will not forsake them. Ooh, you a little bit of fire in those eyes. What now? Uh, I will intently stare at you. All right, um, give me one second. I am going to get a drink. I will be right back. We're going to roll a uh, quick 60-second ad break just so others who join will not need to sit through dumb ads. One second. One minute. Curious. Excuse me. Dum da da dum 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 da da dum. more second we'll be right back all right and we're back
my search for Yu Yu Gin. Mad plan. Okay, where is she supposed to be? She is. Let us search for her. I am a little birdie too. This could be a trap. You mean we? You mean we? Uh, we will kill him. Uh, we will kill him or die trying. Uh, uh. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> that little twerp. Oh, dude. How you doing, Kane? How you doing this evening? I actually don't know. What time zone do you currently reside in? Oh crap, dude, that is a slog. Alright, here we go. Central time zone, okay, so it's not that late for you. I'm doing good. Doing good. Got my uh, six mile run in this morning. It was freaking cold as a witch's teat outside. Good crap. Um, and, uh, I had a pretty good day at work. I have a new, uh, new Navy diving tank that we're designing. Uh, essentially, we're designing an 8-foot, 18-foot deep pool, uh, for the Navy. So that's gonna be a fun one. We have to kind of fast track it, cause, um, the uh, builder is supposed to be having a a, meet, a big meeting with the Navy over it, so uh, they kind of want us to uh, 
get the structural design a little fast track so they'd be able to better uh, represent their uh, construction numbers. So they're trying to revise their bid to be something a little more accurate. But yeah, so that's fun. Because, I mean, we're getting well-paying jobs, but we just don't have a ton of different jobs that we're working on right now. So, so it work, works good in that aspect. We're getting paid good money for what we do, and I don't have to, like, go all crazy in order to be able to complete the jobs. So... mend mend my stuffs but yeah it was it was a little unfortunate that uh weather's been too cold today I wasn't able to go um well on Mondays I have uh, the reason why I'm able to stream in the afternoons is because uh, my daughter my daughters plural they have a gymnastics class so um I'm I'm at home alone uh without them after work for about an hour it's actually going to start becoming two hours. Um, but um, starting next week. Because um, both my kids have... Um, let's repair all this stuff. Because um, both of my kids will have their gymnastics classes at the same time. So I talked about it with my wife and she's like, yeah, I'll just take both of them. That's fine. So that'll open me up to having more uh, lesson, more lessons on Mondays. Um, and next week, I believe, um, high school swimming starts. And I'm supposed to get at least five more clients. Um, so that's going to be, if that pans out, that's an extra hundo per week. Which is mooey nice. Oh, yeah, that's right. Next one. So yeah, I'm actually going to be doing uh, another one of my weekly uh, swim swim technique live streams for uh, for my triathlon group tomorrow night. We're going to be talking about gear, like like swimming gear, like goggles and kickboards and stuff like that. And then um, we're also going to talk uh, racing strategies, going to talk about kind of uh, how to how to better plan out your swim so that um, so that you're 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 feeling good throughout the entire thing. So it's pretty much combining everything that I've been teaching them over the past about month. Excuse me. Yeah, it's been about a month. Been doing it once a week for about a month. So, uh, so we're gonna be talking about all those kinds of fun things because a very small portion of triathletes actually do come from a heavy swimming background. Um, most triathletes they come from a running or a cycling background. 
and then they have to somehow manage to learn swimming. Because, like, for me, I already have a huge boost just because I don't have to worry about swimming. Because, I mean, in theory, yes, I could really train more with swimming. Um, I could train more in swimming, and I could knock off another minute or two off my mile. But right now, I go a 21-minute mile, which is... which honestly puts me in the upper echelon of age group triathletes like like we're talking about top like in my age group i'm probably in the top five percent somewhere around there um but i know for a fact that my bike and uh run legs are absolutely mediocre so i need to uh so i would much rather train on those I would much rather train harder on those, trying to get those times down, which those will definitely give me much more gain, higher gains. From the roof. So what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to kind of teach other members of the uh, of the triathlon team that I'm on, I'm trying to teach them how to how to swim better. Because I mean, what's really nice for me is I'm not that motivated to win events, so I I just want to do the best that I can and whatever that is. And these triathlons give me a really good motivation to stay in shape and uh, you know keep training, keep exercising and stuff. Because I don't have the time to train what I know I need to train in order to be in the upper echelon of the uh, age group that I'm in. I don't have that ability right now. I, I just don't have the time, quite frankly. If I could get in two solid workouts a day, oh, yeah, I could, I could probably be up there. I could be up there. Because with my swimming background and my knowledge of competitions and stuff, I would just, if I had two, two hour, you know, like two, two hour or even two, one and a half hour blocks of my day that I could legitimately train, I could be pretty dang good at triathlons. But I don't. <laughs> I mean, I have I have my I have my training block in the mornings, and that's all I really want to do right now. Especially especially since we're expecting our boy uh, in a couple months here. So it's like even then, I don't know how my competitions are going to go. He comes. Yeah, something tells me I don't think this is going to go well. The village is not far, my lord. If it please you, we shall escort you there directly. Yeah, this isn't going to end well. Nope. than a graveyard, blood and husk of a broken nation devoid of proper sport. Ah, but as his radiance wishes... Yes, yes, of course, my lord. I, 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 and may I say how terribly sorry we are that you had to come so far. Oh, shut up. We labored long to sow the seeds of hatred, of fear, to train them as beasts. Now we shall see the harvest. <laughs> Let there be right? savage beasts baying for blood. 
and not hollow-eyed prey cowering in the dark, or there will be no joy in this hunt. Ugh. Yeah, it, I feel like it's breathing through a snorkel. Dude, breathing through a snorkel is not that much fun. Oh? shall test this new blade of yours. Let us hope it is to my liking, lest your misfortunes compound. Alpha, alpha. Then again, I am loath to expend such effort on the unworthy. Come, earn the honor. And the honor. You die. Leave this to me. All right. I may know how about Cordy. I 
must. Run, beast, run. Beast, run! Don't stop now! Oh, I made it through the battle. Okay. Ah, I remember you, Alamigo, the champion of the savages. Look ye where the sun doth rise, see crimson embers darkening skies. Look ye where the sun doth fall, see azure lost amidst the squall. Oh, my beautiful helmet. Oh, how right I was to spare your life. Hear me, hero. Endure. Survive. Live. It's kind of something weird to be telling me. Oh, pleasure left to me in this empty, ephemeral world. Live! Uh, you're a bit of a loony. Yeah! And... Ice actually has a spine! Yay! You must, you must flee! We're not going anywhere, do you hear me? We're not running away! What you're doing is stupid and reckless, and I never wanted any part of it, but here we are! We finally have a backbone! I've spent my whole life hating myself. For every time they made me beg, for every time I held my tongue, to protect the people I love. 
for me. You came along and reminded me of all the things I never said and never did, and it was even worse. You know, I would have given anything to forget, to walk away, but I knew I'd never be able to live with the guilt. I would have told you to take that blue pill and shoved it straight up your rectal cavity. Or was it the red one? I always forget. So we came, all of us, for you, for ourselves, for Donna! For 42! Death is death, regardless of the reason. <laughs> Holy crap! Yet you seem determined to die, intruding upon this sacred ground, turning weapons you can scarcely wield upon me. Your life didn't begin to address the balance. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> wrong you are go now hi hey. I can't see a damn thing someone stop them Save me, save me, hurt them, hurt them. <gasps> My lord. Right, the final one. All right. <clears throat> All right, you know what? I'm actually fading pretty bad here. Uh, I ran, like I said earlier in the stream, I ran six miles this morning, and I am starting to feel it. So um, I believe that I am going to call it for the night. Um, so uh, the other thing is, um, I will be uh, I will be doing a Zwift stream tomorrow morning. Um, so I'll be out here at 5.15 a.m. Pacific time. So I want to go in and get some sleep just because usually my long run days take a lot out of me. Um, so, uh, so yeah. So we're going to be doing, it's mostly just a recovery ride tomorrow. No workout. Uh, we'll do a workout on Wednesday morning. Uh, we'll do workout Wednesday, workout Thursday, and then Friday I'm going to do a brick workout. So it's gonna be an hour on the bike and then a three mile run. Um, so uh, so yeah, that's that's my. And then on Saturday morning we're gonna do a long ride. Uh, I think we're gonna do a two and a half hour ride on Saturday morning. So that should be fun. Yay! <laughs> so um, so yes, that is going to be it for me tonight. Uh, thank you all so much for tuning in. Um, so Will was on earlier today. Um, by the way, he made a big announcement in the Discord. No, nope. oh, sorry. Um, if you want to, uh, if you want to come in on the Discord, uh, there's a link to it. Also, check out LDS Gamers. I'm affiliated with them. Uh, very nice group of guys and gals. Um, committed to high standards of gaming, family friendly entertainment. Um, all sorts of gaming groups are on their Discord. So uh, just go to the website, ldsgamers.com. Uh, you'll be able to link up with the Discord and meet all of us in there. Um, also, if uh, make sure you're in the Takaria, as that is where all news Takaria related will be. Um, so, uh, so yes. Um, yeah. Yeah, because just for the rest of the week, we're playing Fall Fantasy XIV, except for Friday. 
Um, there is no stream Saturday night. Uh, that is because I will be at a hockey game with my wife and, a, and another couple that we know. Um, so uh, I will not be, be I will not be streaming that night. So we will be doing Left Alive on Friday. Uh, we'll be doing Chapter Three of that game, which Chapter Two was just. Mm. Chapter Two was glorious. Can't wait for Chapter Three. So uh, that's all I got for tonight. Thank you all so much for tuning in. I really appreciate all of those who are up at this crazy hour um, that do not live on the West Coast. Um, I always appreciate anyone and everyone. The streams while at hockey game. <laughs> yeah, no. Nah. That's, that's date night, man. You don't stream during date night unless your date is next to you playing a game with you. Which, my lady, my lady Mrs. The Pharaoh will not be playing games with me. So, because uh, usually she is sleepy sleep at this hour. <laughs> so, all right. Thank you so much, Kane, for tuning in. As always, uh, Will um, Will will now uh, sign off at midnight. So uh, nine o'clock Pacific time is uh, when he will be signing off. Um, I just spoke with him earlier, so he's he is trying to get his, his sleep schedule back onto a more normal schedule, which I very much so commend him for and encourage him to do. Uh, so he will be joining me typically until about nine o'clock and that's when he will knock off and go to bed himself. So, uh, yep. So that's kind of the state of the stream. Things are going good. Still enjoying doing this, having lots of fun, just hanging out and chatting and whatnot. Cause quite frankly, during my work day, I don't talk. I'm not really encouraged to talk. So I kind of need an outlet for yammering and yakking. That's what this that's what this mostly is. This is mostly just, hey, I can talk and I don't feel like a crazy person. Just interior monologuing all the time. Oh, exteriorly exteriorly interior monologuing. Um that's that's what I like to call talking to myself. So <laughs> All right, that's it. I'm 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 just babbling here. Good night, Isaiah Norris, wherever you are. See you tomorrow morning at about five fifteen for a Zwift stream. Good night, everyone.